Hello, it's Biblio Virgo. You can call me Ryan. I am talking to you guys about my Reading Rush update. A lot has happened. My TBR did not stay the same because it wasn't smart of me to put two 400 page books in the mix because it's just very unrealistic to try and get those done in a day when I still have my life going on. Where I was talking with a group of friends on Instagram and it's like, wouldn't it just be nice to kind of like book a whole week off work just to do a readathon? I mean, like in my head, that's a great idea, but in reality, not not so much. So the first book I finished for Purple on the Cover was Rain and Delilah's Midnight Matinee, and this book shook me. When a book makes me cry and I love it so much and I rate it five stars, I can't really talk about how much I like it and why I like it, because it comes out better through a written word, so I will be having my official review of this book up on my website next week. <clears throat> so my second book was supposed to be the third book of the Harry Potter series. Obviously that did not happen because it's too thick of a book. Um, and the second book was supposed to be a book you could read in one spot. So I chose For One More Day by Mitch Album. Mitch Album never lets me down. His writing is beautiful. His stories are so intricate and just the way they're laid out. It's so personable. I rated this four stars. Yesterday's book was another one that just kind of ripped my heart open. Um, this was a book that you wanted to read last year, and I really should have read this last year because this book is phenomenal. Turtles All the Way Down by John Green. Again, I will be having a blog post for this one on my website sometime next week. So today's is supposed to be a debut novel. I was going to read the program by Suzanne Suzanne Young. I had to bend down and see the author name because uh, it's on my bottom shelf. But again, that book was 400 pages. So I chose um, Lanny by Max Porter. This is a debut novel of his this year and it was sent to me by Penguin Random House Canada. I don't know where it's going and I'm very confused and it seems very dark and eerie and that is all I can say about this book right now. I don't understand. Okay. <clears throat> So, so far it looks like I'm on a good track to read a book a day. Um, I'm one third of the way through Lanny, so I should be able to finish it today, even though I do have other things to do. I didn't think that I was actually going to be able to read seven books in seven days, but um, the more that I've been reading and the more that I'm kind of going through the reading rush, I feel like it's possible. And it's really awesome because like, I've been having a lot of group chats and stuff too to kind of keep me on track and keep me motivated. <clears throat> So I hope the reading rush is going great for you too, and I hope, you know, your reading is going great too. Um, if you'd like to follow me on Instagram or if you'd like to check out my website and Twitter, I left some links down below. Thanks for watching.